we'll guide you through how to set up a wireless keyboard and mouse. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Wireless peripherals can be much easier because they don't have cables across your desk. So let's get started. Your peripherals may have come with a dongle. As you can see, I've got dongles here. If they didn't, don't worry. If they did, what we can do is go and connect these to our computer. What you can then do is if your mouse and keyboard have batteries that need to be put in, put them in or go and charge them. And if they go and have a switch, you can go and switch them on. You can see this keyboard does on the top right and this mouse does as well. With some wireless keyboards and mice, there's gonna be a plug and play system. So when it's all turned on and the receiver is connected, they'll just go and work. In some cases, you'll need to go and get drivers and go and connect them. In other cases, you may need drivers or you may need to go and connect them somehow. Alternatively, if you don't go and have USB receivers or some wireless keyboards may have receivers and also have at the Bluetooth feature. So with Bluetooth, we can go and connect them without using the receiver. For example, here we are on my computer. Open your settings by pressing search at the bottom and type in settings or press the Windows start button and open settings. Go to the left and press Bluetooth and devices and you can then press add device. We can press Bluetooth. And what we need to do is go and put them into pairing mode. This will vary depending upon your mouse and keyboard, but it should be similar. Make sure it's switched on and then press and hold down on the sync button. I'll choose number three and press and hold. I can then go and select it with, oh, we've now successfully set it up and I can press done and I'll do the same for my keyboard. I'll press that device. Once again, I need to make sure that it's switched on, which it is, and I can then go and choose which connection I want. I'll use three, so I'll tap and hold it like so till it starts flashing. I can then select it like so, and I'll need to enter in the pin. I've now successfully connected it, and I've gone and set up my wireless mouse and keyboard. So there's different ways you can do it depending upon your devices.